Hello, Assalamu Alaikum. My name is Zanu. So today we are going to read Unit 2 Grandparents and learn some new word meanings from the book English Language for Grade 8, Balochistan Textbook Board Quetta, in Urdu and as well as in English. So let's start. Word meanings. The first word is generation. It means offspring, breed, a race. I am not going to read the Urdu meaning because of shortage of time. The second word is affection, attachment, kindness, goodwill, unconditional, not limited by conditions, absolute, infinite, unlimited or boundless, special, particular, uncommon, bond, link of connection, wisdom, knowledge or sagacity, expert, Experienced relationships, the state of being connected. Misery, a cause or source of great distress or discomfort. Symbols, a thing that represents or stands for something. Wealth, an abundance of valuable possessions or money. Values, worth, patience. The capacity to accept or tolerate link. Brotherhood. The relationships between brothers. Cooperation. The action or process of working together. Discover. Find during the search. Hardship. Severe suffering or privation. Strict. Demanding that rules concerning behavior are obeyed and observed. Young. Having lived or existed for only a short time, perhaps used to express un uncertainty or possibility. Suggestion, an idea or plan put forward for consideration. Inside out, with the inner surface turned outwards. Reveal, make previously unknown or secret information known to others. Advice, guidance or recommendations. Entrusted. Assign the responsibility for doing something. Lifestyle. The way in which a person lives. Contacts. The action of communicating or meeting. C. The place where an incident in real life or fiction occurs or occurred. Situation. A set of circumstances in which one finds oneself. A state of affairs. Different. Not the same. Customs. Traditional and widely accepted way of behaving or doing something that is specific to a particular society, place or time. Beacon. A light or other visible object serving as a signal. Reverence. Deep respect for someone or something. Elder. Person of a greater age. Traditions. The transmission of customs or beliefs from generation to generation or the fact of being passed on in this way. Role models. A person looked to by others as an example to be imitated. Primary source. Earliest in time or order. Benefit. An advantage or profit gained from something. Advice. Guidance or recommendations. Now we are going to read this passage. I am going to read it in English, but you are going to read it yourself in Urdu. Grandparents are like a shady tree which are always there to offer their cool shade to their next generation. It seems that they have all the love, affection and warmth in the world stored within them. The unconditional and infinite love creates a special bond between the two generations. More than the parents, Grandparents feel the pain when the child gets hurt or starts crying. It is a fact that the grandparents look like the happiest individuals in the world when they spend time with their grandchildren. Grandparents are the symbols of wisdom. They speak from their experiences and guide us in every walk of life. Page 2 they are usually experts at relationships. Many of us have learned at their knees things that, that have saved us from pain and misery in later life.
It is grandparents who tell us that though money and other symbols of wealth are nice to have, the real values in life are honesty, love, patience, respect for elders, brotherhood, truth, and cooperation. They themselves had probably discovered the hardships and experiences of life. We often see them trying to make up to their children or parents for having been strict, perhaps even unkind to them when they were young. As it often turns out, they often try to parent us to make up for their mistakes they made in parenting their own children. Being thus close to them, many of us who listen to them are saved from making the same mistakes. Today, children often look up to their grandparents for suggestions since they know the grandparents have seen and faced the real world inside out. Children often reveal secrets and problems about their life to their grandparents and, and they offer them valuable advice on how to deal with the problems. Being the most experienced persons in the family, they are also entrusted with the responsibility of keeping the family together. But unfortunately, as part of modern lifestyle, we are losing contact with our grandparents. Being the most experienced persons in the family, they are also entrusted with the responsibility of keeping the family together. But unfortunately, as part of the modern lifestyle, we are losing contact with our grandparents. We are pushing them out of scene. Many of them are being sent to old houses or not being given their due respects in homes. But the situation in Pakistan is a bit different. Most of the Pakistani families follow the joint family system and give much respect to their customs and traditions and pay due attention to family values. Each member of the Pakistani family has respect for the older family members. The grandparents are considered as a beacon in a traditional Pakistani family where they are treated in reverence. They work together with other elder family members to solve the problems and pass their skills and experiences on to the next generation. They are good role models and looked upon as the primary source of guidance. It is our responsibility to give them their due respect and spend time with them so that not only they could be happy but we also could benefit from their advice and experiences. That's it for today's lesson. Please subscribe our channel, press the bell icon so you can get our latest notification and give this video a like if you enjoyed. Allah Hafiz.